Welcome to a new series on the channel. This is Madden 21, or basically, it's Madden 20 with Madden 21 rosters, and I had an idea. It's going to be the Player revi Revival Franchise. The player that I'm going to be picking for this series is going to be another other than Josh Rosen. Every team that he's been put on, he's been pretty much shafted. Even though he's not that bad of a quarterback, he just hasn't had no line. But with Patrick and Tua Tagalova, I think that's how you say his name, being on the Dolphins, he's not going to get any chances. So we're going to trade for him right now. We traded him. We traded Peyton Barber in a 7th round pick for Josh Rosen. Now, as you, say, as you see on my team, let me get to it real quick. We're on the Redskins. We still have Alex Smith, Dwayne Haskins, and Kyle Allen all on the team at quarterback. I'm sorry, but one of these people are definitely not going to be on the team anymore. And it might be Dwayne Haskins, especially because Josh Rosen, technically his his real life contract is gonna be a little different than this, but I don't care. Dwayne Haskins is the same age as Rosen, and I understand that he's a rookie. Well, technically one year, whatever, um, and he would be able to probably get up a little higher quicker. I don't care. I'm toy I'm trading Dwayne Haskins. I don't care. Just don't care. I decided I'm actually not going to trade any of these quarterbacks because Haskins would put way too big of a penalty on me. Alex Smith would put way big, way too big of a penalty on me. So just in case Josh Rosen doesn't make it, we can make this play a revival of Dwayne Haskins. Okay, running back. We've got Darius Geis, Adrian Peterson, J.D. McKissick, McKissick, and Antonio Gibson. Definitely more of a elusive back, which we do need. And they have Bryce Love. Okay. McKissick is probably going to... Yeah. McKissick... Mc, McKissick... I can't talk today. Is going to be gone here. I'll take... I'll... I'm more than happy to take the penalty. Um, let me just see how much... Oh, yeah. I got cap room. I got cap room for days. I... I'd much rather take this loss take the L on him since I got running backs for days here that guys Peterson Gibson Bryce love because I have an idea of what I want I want to get rid of my fullback wide receiver we have way too much. so I'll get back whatever I have this all done I'm back oh my so I only got rid of I think two receivers so we have one two three four five six seven receivers which is still a lot but I think after their some of their contracts go won't be as bad but oh my god they have way too many tight ends i'm getting rid of most of them uh actually if anything i might not have a i don't might not need a tight end ever i'm thinking about running a lot of split back um ooh, thaddeus moss we're keeping him uh though just in case he has a shot here um We'll keep two tight ends. Um, because we're going to be running a lot of shotgun. Um, okay, so left tackle. Ooh, yeah. And then, so we got these two. Left guard. Still not great. Passing's not wonderful. Okay. Center's not too bad. Right guard. Hmm, really? Brandon Sheriff. Decent. Hold on. Is this technically the last year of his contract? Ah, well, hmm, hold on. Yeah. Okay, this is technically his last year of his contract, even though it shouldn't be. Um, left end, we got Kerrigan, Montez Sweat, Cameron Malou. Oh, also we're running a 4-3 now. Um, I'm using, like, the Seahawks defense. He's really good off the edge. And Chase Young, interesting. Um, okay, D-tackle. Got a lot of D-tackles here. Um, we can get rid of the last three, because none of them are good. Let's see here, let's see here. Hopefully this sounds good also um yeah so my whole goal is hopefully to bring back josh rosen and give him a chance to try to like become good 
And man, mmm, hold on a second. I might move one of these guys to end and then maybe go to 3-4, maybe. Uh, no, we'll probably have to, have to stick with 4-3 at least. It's just, I don't know, with Montez Sweat being so fast off the edge, maybe just I'll use... Because we have too many D-Tackles, so I might try to trade one of these D-Tackles. Um, wow, Cole Holcomb, 87 speed. He's probably going to start for us. Solid. Okay, CBs. Okay, we have a lot of crappy ones. I, run a, I want to run, like, man defense. So, we'll get rid of Danny Johnson, and we'll get rid of Simon Thompson. Thomas. Uh, we'll put Strowman on the trade block because he's more of a zone guy. That's close enough with Faber and Monroe. Free safety. We are bad. <laughs> we are so bad at free. We're getting rid of these bums. Also, so I'm basically saying this is the current off season. Like technically we're in the preseason, but there's still a lot of free agents, and I do want to pick up a couple to give us a shot here. Yeah, mm, he's. 25 he's 22 they're all kind of young i might trade kerrigan actually i mean yeah his he's a good pass rusher and run stuff but i almost need to put either deron Payne or jonathan allen at the left end since because like not because i run a 4-3 so i guess having three good guys is good but i'd much rather get like a guy like a different guy so Kerrigan might be going we'll put Kerrigan on the block as well and then is there anyone else no I think I'm good so we'll go look at free agents now okay so at left tackle we're gonna sign Cordy Glenn to a one-year deal wish you could do more than one year deal but oh well since we need a better left tackle. I know we have that rookie. And I'm going to probably try to develop him. Simile is still a free agent here. Okay. Center. We're good. Right guard. We're good. Right tackle. I think we're good. Left end. Clowny is still there. But we don't need any of these guys. D tackle. I'm gonna try to just get a block shedding guy. We're gonna sign Xavier Williams to a one year deal. Ooh, Logan Ryan is still on free agents here. Let's do man coverage. Darquez Denard. Anyone super eye catching? Not really. Okay, free safety. We need, ah, uh, ah, uh, not Bethea. Oh, jeez, I'm so stupid. So, who was that, Eric Weddle? Did Weddle retire? Hmm. Um, Tedrick Thompson. 75 zone. Let's look at strong safeties. Tony Jefferson, Rashad Jones, Eric Berry. I might get Eric Berry. Ooh, Eric Reed who hits hard. Yep, we're gonna sign Eric Berry. Coming out here probably for one of his last years ever in the league. I'm gonna move him to free safety. Okay, so so far this is gonna be the team. The, the depth chart here. So here's the depth chart. We have Josh Rosen, Haskins, and Alex Smith. Technically, Alex Smith is still injured, but whatevs. Running back, Darius Geis, Adrian Peterson, Antonio Gibson, and Bryce Love. A wide receiver, Terry McLaurin, Cody Lattimore, Trey Quinn, Kevin Harmon. And then Antonio Gandy-Golden. Tight end, Thaddeus Moss and Richard Rogers. Left tackle, we got Cordy Glenn. Left guard, we're going to start our rookie left tackle, 
Charles. Center, Chase Rollier. Right guard, Brandon Sheriff. Right tackle, Morgan Moses. Left end, we got Ryan Kerrigan for now. Right end, Chase Young. D tackle, Matthew Ioannidis and Deron Payne and then Jonathan Allen for now. Left outside linebacker, Cole Holgum. Middle linebacker, Ruben Foster, sadly. I do not like this guy. If he doesn't play well, Pierre Lewis will get the start. And then, old man, Thomas Davis Sr. And then CB Kendall Fuller, Ronald Darby, Fabian Moreau. Free safety, Eric Berry. And then finally, strong safety, Landon Collin. And I'll be back after I put in all the sliders and everything. Josh Rosen, of course. To make it, like, equal to the rest of the league, I'm just gonna do uh, this uh, to make it even harder on myself. I'm gonna make it so we can't that we have to use like the base ones like this. So this is gonna be fun. Let's start training here. I'll see you when I get back. Okay, we have two upgrades. We have Ronald Darby and Eric Barry. I'm gonna upgrade these players when I get to the end of the preseason. So I'm gonna start the preseason now. We're gonna sim it. Uh, week by week and check the free agents list and everything to see how this goes. Okay, so uh, We got mentorship here Glenn wants to mentor Charles We're gonna do pass blocking uh, Finesse pass blocking. I should have done run block, but okay, so we lost our first game here We're gonna check the free agents list Okay, people definitely got picked up. Uh, I'm trying to remember what transactions. Transactions. So, 49ers re-sign Aaron Lynch. Ron Parker goes to the Broncos. Rashad Jones goes to the Seahawks. Maurice Alexander goes to the Vikings. Penn comes out of retirement and goes to the Saints. Alec Ogletree goes to the Saints. Montez Perfect goes to the Patriots. Mike Daniels goes to the Bears. Brandon Marshall goes to the Raiders. Preston Brown goes to the Eagles. Mark Barron goes to the Jags. Antonio Brown goes to the Buccaneers. And he meets up with Tom Brady and Gronk. Jordan Reed goes to the Cowboys. Delaney Walker goes to the Bengals. Tony Jefferson goes to the Cardinals, which I might be wrong. I think he played for them at some point, but I might be wrong on that. Darren Lee goes to the Colts. Pernell McPhee goes to the Dolphins. Ziggy Ansa re-signs with the Seahawks. That's weird. Andrew Luck comes out of retirement and goes to the Patriots for one year. Zach Brown goes to the Falcons. Jason Peters comes out of retirement and goes to the Chargers. Clay Matthews goes to the Browns. Kalichi Osimile goes to the Eagles. Jadavian Cloudy goes to the Colts. Freeman goes to the Chargers. Marcel Darius goes to the Bucks. And that's where it'll end. Oh, Damian Harrison gets signed by the Giants. That's weird. Okay, let's let's train again here. Week three, and look at this. Cordy Glenn wants to mentor Charles some more. He receives three awareness. Let's go. Week three, we win a game. Week two, let's just train real quick before we look at the transaction see if anyone else got picked up okay we're back here to the transaction there was a trade 49ers traded dj jones to the vikings for a second round pick a seventh round pick and another seventh round pick des bryant goes to the browns taylor gabriel goes to the falcons austin Severian jenkins goes to the saints cyprian goes to the dolphins Dolphins release Malcolm Perry. Giants sign Cam Newton. Ooh. Daniel Jones not looking too hot. Dion Buchanan goes to the Bears. And any other crazy ones? Muhammad Wilkerson goes to the Bucks. Jabal Sheard goes to the Cardinals. Lamar Miller goes to the Rams. Marshawn Lynch goes back to the Bills where he started. Akeem Tlaib goes to the Broncos. Cameron Wake. Beecham and John Halpio, sorry, all go to the Bengals. Wow. Time to, s well, let's see, oh, that schedule, sorry, I messed that up. Let's see what the stats are looking like so far. Okay, so Rosen's not doing too hot, but Dwayne Haskins is doing good in the preseason. Uh-oh, I still want to use 
Rose in. And I didn't really give up much for Rose. And I gave up a third running back and a seventh round pick. Oh, the trade offers for Ryan Kerrigan. Let's see what they are. 2021 second round pick. Or would it be 2022 in this case? Uh, wow, Seahawks really want Kerrigan. So do the Rams, Patriots. I mean, if I can get first, that'd be cool. Okay, we'll see. Let's see who I can get the most picks from. Second, sixth, seventh, third, fifth, seventh. I'll take a second round pick in the future and a sixth and a seventh for Ryan Kerrigan. To oh, I don't want to give him to the Bengals though, or not the Bengals, because we're both in the NFC. So I'd like to give him to the AFC. Uh. Jets. He's NFC. If anything, I'll give him to the Seahawks. Yep, we're good. We're gonna do Seahawks here. I know they're NFC, but do we face them? I don't think so. So now I need to make someone a left end, and I think it's gonna be Jonathan Allen. I mean, Jerron Payne is the fastest, but so now. Jonathan Allen is at left end with Montez Sweat, which is good because Sweat can come out on the, uh, uh, pass, uh, as a pass rusher. Yep, first. Okay. And then the nice part is at the tackle, we can have Allen and Ioannidis. Okay. We should be good. Um, okay. We need to cut four players. Yay. Okay. I have no trade offers. Let's go to roster here i'll be back whenever i'm done uh cutting players okay i think i made enough yeah i definitely made enough uh things uh let's see who is all left larry fitzgerald got cut what they finally decided to part ways wow I'm shocked. That's insane. Um, I think I'm going to pick up Larry Fitzgerald. I know I'm going to get one year out of him, but he'll help this receiving core. And Joe Flacco. Wow. Okay, let's just see transactions here. Oh, I hit the X-Factor database like a dummy. Give me a second. Transact. Okay, so we'll look at signed. Uh, we've, okay. Demarius Thomas got signed to the Steelers. Torrey Smith got signed to the Packers. Dwayne Allen's with the Packers. Jaleel Day is with the Eagles. Jared Verdeer is with the Seahawks. Um, Stephon Anthony's with the Browns. Terrell Suggs to the Lions. That's scary. Vinatieri to the Jets. Carlos Hyde to the Bucks. Tremaine Johnson to the Giants. Okay, and then let's see who all got released. Okay, released. Let's see if there's anyone that pops out to me. So yeah, Larry Fitzgerald got released. That's crazy. And no one else really... We're back here. No one else really popped out to me. So we're just going to look at the free agents one more time. And just see if there's anyone that I really want. So you're going to be here with me. So no good quarterbacks. Running backs are fucking... Sorry for swearing. But completely filled. Wide receivers. Left tackle. Don't need one. Left guard. We do need one. Right guard. I can move to left guard. Eh. We'll deal. Left end. We're fine. The tackle. We're fine. Marlon Davidson. I'm trying to think. He's good. Like, he's really good. Okay. Well, what the heck? Jordan Elliott got cut too. Right at. Crazy. Left at. Or left outside linebacker. No linebacker. Patrick. Well, really? Dang, son. Uh, nothing crazy. Free safety. Nothing crazy. Strong safety. Nothing crazy. Okay. We're all almost at the end of preseason here we just got cut one more player We're gonna move kyle allen to the practice squad we're gonna trade real quick Get train real quick here here i'm gonna edit this i know i really shouldn't but chase young is gonna need at least superstar but then we'll do bangles quarterback joe burrow put him up to superstar that's all i'm gonna do the rest could kind of go screw themselves but last week of simulation we're just good okay so we're here week one of the nfl season we're here to try to make josh rosen have a chance but first we need to upgrade our players okay we're gonna try to make him more of a run well let's try to fish him out make him make him have 90 pass uh power rush um drone drone pain um i want to make him more of a pass rusher as well so we'll do power rusher there we go power moves are now 81 good chase young gets speed rusher here ronald darby gets man to man adrian peterson the old man i want to give him power back eric barry gets probably his final upgrade here i'm putting him into zone uh 
Ooh, Josh Rosen got an upgrade here. We're gonna upgrade his, uh, no, we'll upgrade his strong arm, see if we can get him up to 90 throw power. Of course not. Um, Cody Lattimore, see what his stats are looking like. 90 seed, doesn't really have route running, so we'll give him physical. And we're just gonna upgrade the rest here. Okay, we are finally here. Week one, let's see if there's any other transactions that have happened. Cardinal signed Taysom Hill to a one-year contract. Colts signed Jordan Elliott. Vikings trade Danico Autry for a third round, a fifth round, and another fifth round from the Colts. Michael Pittman Jr. goes to the Saints. Trent Taylor gets signed by the Cardinals. Sua Cravens gets signed by the Patriots. Andre Branch gets Picked up by the Seahawks. See if there's anyone else that like shouts at me here. I don't think so. No. Okay. Now let's let me just pull the free agents list, fix my depth chart, and get into the first game of the season.